Iran's president delivered an anti-American, anti-Western harangue at the annual UN General Assembly meeting today. Diplomats from the U.S. and more than 30 other countries walked out when Mahmoud Ahmadinejad called Western countries arrogant powers that threaten anyone who questions the Holocaust and September 11th. During this U.N. session, no one has been busier than Secretary of State Hillary Clinton. Today alone, she attended nine events all over Manhattan, covering everything from counterterrorism to third world economics. Who keeps her safe as she travels from place to place and country to country? Jim Axelrod got a rare inside look. With New York City on high alert, the most highly protected woman in town is Secretary of State Hillary Clinton. Oh, I know, my friend, how are you? For the State Department's Bureau of Diplomatic Security, this week is a carefully coordinated dance, a year in the planet, involving dogs, machine guns, armored vehicles, and 80 agents. Copy, take an next right, entering shoot. Bill Embry directs the Secretary's motorcade and took us inside the security bubble. What kind of things are you hearing in your ear? Um, listening to any cars that might be approaching us from every angle. Vehicles, pedestrians, bicycles, anything strange going down the road. You don't feel any more comfortable or safer operating in midtown Manhattan than you do in, in some third world country? Not really. No matter where I'm at, I, I'm always worried about the, the safety and security of Secretary Clinton. Secretary Clinton and her motorcade are on the move right now to the United Nations for discussions about nuclear security. There are more than 40 high-level diplomats under the protection of the State Department this week. Secretary Clinton doesn't move without you, correct? That's correct. I go everywhere she goes. Kurt Olson is in charge of the Secretary's security detail, protecting Mrs. Clinton from the threat of terrorists. We're fairly certain that, of course, she's high in their minds as a potential target, and that's the mindset that we carry with us wherever we go. In her first two years, Clinton traveled more than any Secretary of State in history. There's Olson with her in Madrid, India, and Abu Dhabi. You literally have, have woken up and not known what country you were in sometimes? Happens all the time. Olson's major concern this week? During the UN General Assembly, even Hillary Clinton gets stuck in traffic. You don't like it when things slow down. We do not like it. Motion is your friend. Perpetual motion until we get to the next location. That's what we want. Pull back copy, site remains. This morning, there was another trip to the UN for the multitasking Clinton, who was on her Blackberry as she headed into a meeting. 15 minutes later, she was back in her car and off. In a week of big headlines, her security agents will have done their jobs if they've stayed out of the news. Jim Axelrod, CBS News, New York.